Hi again, this is Stephen from Victory Programming, and this is our next lesson, Intermediate Program 2. We're going to dive right into some new topics. So it looks like we need to measure the side pocket on this part with these holes. And then on sheet 2, we're going to measure uh, this bolt pattern with a composite position and some runout and roundness. Why do you think we took the datums in a specific order? There we go. That's that's going to work a lot better. We have plenty of shank clearance on that. Just click on this surface and this surface. And now we have a center line. There's actually two ways to set up your datums. You can do it directly in the position characteristic or you can use a secondary line. It's calculating to that symmetry point towards the x minus axis. So now it makes a helical path on there. The lower segment is a refinement of that. It's more like controlling the spacing of those holes. And we can organize our program. I like to move all the constructed features to the end of the program. The A angle is the head of the probe rotating around the vertical Z shaft. After you run the part, you can take a look at the results and let's show you how to set up some plots. Now you can see the relative deviation of each center point. You can see there's a bump there, and that would be considered an outlier. So this is shown with the outlier turned off. Good job again, and I'm here for you if you have any questions to clarify this stuff. The learning is a process, and keep up the good work.